uh, banking sucks and 69% or it's true only 69% of the Filipinos actually use it and only 39% of those actually save with it so what's going wrong and maybe the later generation are too late to change because already stuck in their own way so you guys should be targeting the younger generation because that's where the money's at okay so anyway here we have Reg she has the money pot right now and and she's basically going to choose she's got two items she's currently saving up for so she's going to choose which one she wants to put it into and and then so she has currently 1500 pesos this is connected to the union bank api so there we go she's choose and you see it's all real time and she's deposited some money in there so basically what's going on here okay so she has two items she's currently saving up for she has visualization of how long she's going to get to her goals and there's also a vault on the side here if you, if you deposit your money in there, it's stuck in there, your parents have a PIN number and the money can't come out until you, and let's say, when they give it to you. Anyway, so what is this? First of all, uh, uh, like parents forget to have balance sometimes in their money for pocket money, whatever, for children. So you can have automatic transactions through this, that's nothing new. Maybe we can start adding some chores. If they walk the dog, clean their room or whatever, I'm going to send a notification actually. Hang on. Uh, I'm in America or whatever, and then I just contacted my child, obviously she's not, she should get a notification. Uh, babe, you're gonna open it, babe, you got a notification. <laughs> and, you got it? What? You send it? Have you received it? Okay, anyway, well, all right, okay. All right, anyway, I'm gonna send a notification. You're on the internet, right? You're connected to the internet. Okay. <laughs> Uh, anyway, so she should get a notification. Then then close it. Close it yeah. yeah. There we go. Hey, okay. No. Okay. Anyway, we're gonna carry on. Anyway, she'll better get real, show the achievements. So she better get notifications. Show the achievement. And then you better have different achievements. So you better go towards your, your achievement. Yeah. You better go towards your goals. So say at the moment at the top there, you know, she's done a few of her chores. And I can change the count there, whatever, to 20. And then she's obviously completed it and it's gone in real time there. So you better to get achievements when adding social media. And then she's going to get points for saving up. Maybe you're going to add in a game if you go to the shop. You're going to add in like a, maybe a business management game or something. And bring in online social aspects. So you should be able to spend extra points or whatever. Maybe aim for 8 to 16 years old. I don't know, but like pay Maya. I think they, their card is at 12. So you guys maybe should be targeting younger. Six years old isn't too early to start banking, especially with something like this. Because I mean, they should start getting in young. And if you get them in young, they're going to stay with you for the rest of your life. And that's what you want as a bank anyway. So uh, anyway, they're going to learn more management. And I don't know where that came out from. Anyway, so anyway, you're going to go on next to family members. You go to the profile settings. Uh, they can have complete control of your account, like maybe right uh, settings. So this is a bit of a, well, this, that's what she has in the vault. That's her money pot to spend. And she can disable maybe Visa, so she can to go to the ATM. Maybe she can only use it in the shop. The whole point of this, we don't want to give you 20 pesos for cleaning your room, because you're going to go out there and spend it on sweets, and that's not going to go nowhere. So you want to use it like this. You can't spend e-money as easy, but it is real money, and it's better. So, yeah, I mean, I don't know where else to go with this. Um, other family members could maybe contribute, link this up, so if they're saving up, their birthday's coming up, they can see what they're saving up for, and they maybe, I want to contribute to them, you know, they can see their achievements, oh, they've walked the dog 50 times or whatever, like, nice one, you know, they can, they can chuck in a little bit into their money pump. Uh, what else am I missing? I don't know. Uh, stats? What's in stats? I don't know, I can't remember. Oh yeah, obviously you want to keep, like, monthly statements of your bank account, scroll down a bit, like, I mean, money earned, uh, money ratio spent, very simple UI, just to get them into a bit of banking and things like that. Um, what else is going on right there? I don't know. Um, let's see. Well, I don't know what I wrote on here. Okay, yeah, incentives for banking. Like I said points. Everyone loves Viber now. They get any stickers. I don't like them, but I don't know. But a lot of people do. And you can maybe start introducing your own like points, stickers for people to use. I'll go to the profile. Uh, there's like a little avatar. Maybe buy little points and stuff like this so you can dress them up. You know, just like oh, we didn't get to finish that. So maybe go to the profile. I'm sorry, I forgot about that. Uh, yeah. <laughs> Other family members can contribute. I don't know. I think I'm. I don't know. <laughs> how many? How much time do I have left? Oh, no. You can ask questions. <laughs> Sorry, I don't know. Talking too much. Sorry. So, so you you came here with this idea and you expounded on it, or 
you started the hackathon without an idea whatsoever, then you came out with this one? I think what he's saying, I haven't slept in 36 hours, I don't know, but um, like two days ago we thought about it, like the night before the hackathon, we're like, what do we do? And, yeah, and then this is what we, we really wanted to split up banking, like you have one banking statement. And it's hard to freaking save up when you have just this and the history. We'd like to have a company just split it up into separate things. I have a car. I want to to drag my seat. It's still one account that starts splitting it up. This is the concept we're having here. So I hope you can see how it could make it sound. And, to... and you were able to integrate it with the APIs? Yeah, it's Union Bank API. And then it's all like live data. So, um, like, where's your. If you go to the money pop. And then, uh, so, like, I can just add in some digits there. Yeah, well, it's just, you know, yeah. Uh, I, I can see you've had too much coffee, but uh, yeah. this is good. So, so this is a good idea. Mm -hmm. I like the UI. That's uh, my god. Oh, the notification came, yeah, but like, there it is. No, I, Blame Union yeah, Bank's net, sorry. Yeah, I like the UI because it's, if it's targeted for kids, uh, I think the next thing you need to do, I mean, it's just 36 hours, right? So, yeah. whatever happens here, I, I think you... You should take this forward and create this like uh, marketing app. Okay. Uh, of course, integrate as much more APIs. This is what we want to do. So, so you can you can you can build an idea. Yeah, I'd like to take I take that as good advice. Just need to do this. I told you. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. So yeah, I suggested it to the other team. I think uh, should go into the move and bank model. Model. So basically. Uh, People who just recently invested in something like they bought a car, they bought a house. So the, the pain point that Moven Bank saw was that most people don't track their finances unless they just uh, bought something okay. with high ticket, right? So yeah. then you want to track really like, uh, for example, if I bought this pro I bought this frappuccino, mm -hmm. it actually impacts my uh, my financial yeah. stability. So, so this, I think that's the next iteration. So beyond saving, is uh, creating a way to track uh, financial stability of people who actually are in a, in a financial, financially unstable situation. One thing we would have liked to add, we didn't have time, was like a projection, like saying, comparing the money you spent already to how much you could have had now. So they can start realizing, damn, if I didn't buy those useless games or whatever, I'd have this much money right now. So, and the management game is gonna start getting thinking into business and things like that, you know. I don't know, as I said, I've had no, too much coffee. Yeah, so, so for, uh, so you can take it into two directions. Both idea is good. If you can industrialize this, give it to the professionals and all, you have to change the UI though. Yeah, yeah, yeah. For me, you can also take the other direction of keep it to the young crowd mm -hmm. and maybe, maybe have this uh, syndicated with some White Kingdom or all those stuff where they, yeah, yeah. If, if they, and you incorporate some chores and some yeah, and some like and all. Chicken and chickens. Sorry. Cool. It's cool. Cool. Like, we had like, you know, you guys to release new ones whenever in the app, like they have like 50 goals done and Einstein, yeah. like they've got a great school or whatever, you know, like, just, yeah. With Kitsania. Mm. Take it. Yeah, do it.